In Snowbreak, there are logistic officers, and they're basically the equipment of the game with main stats, substats, and set effects. The topic of this video is focused on min-maxing the substats or the talent using the game's terminology. So, when it comes to logistic officers, there are actually four pieces, two which are not influenced by RNG. We have the set effects that are tied directly to the set itself and does not change, and also the attribute. The attribute is tied to which piece you're looking at. For the left piece or the intelligence, you have flat attack, flat defense, and percentage max health. For the middle piece or the medical officer, they have flat defense, flat HP, and percentage attack increase. And for the red piece or the material officers, they have flat attack, flat max HP, and percentage defense increase. The stats are completely static and grow with the level. There is no RNG involved in this part and percentage stats also max out at level 12 instead of 15. The other two pieces belong to the talent. The first two talent come with the gear itself, which you can immediately see what it is when you actually get the piece. The third talent, however, only appear when you max out the officer's level. These two set of talents actually function very differently as well. The first two talents have possibility of having percentage max health, percentage attack, percentage defense, crit damage, crit rate, skill haste, alignment index, S energy recovery, and U energy recovery. They all have 5 different levels you can get, and you get what you get. There is currently no way to change them. The third talent on the other hand can have elemental damage bonus, auxiliary unit power, shield power, and healing power. They also have 5 different tiers, however, you can reroll them. To reroll them, you will use an item called Revision Application. You can only reroll the third talent. One good thing about this rerolling system is that you can choose to keep the old talent or the new one, which means you're not really risking anything except the application itself when you reroll. If you wonder where you can get this, for now it's only available from the exchange shop for Underground Purge, which costs 300 crystals, but it might become available in future events as well. When come to actually min-maxing, you basically want to look for the perfect first two talent, and then once you find a good one, you can reroll for the third talent for stats that matches the specific characters. And if you really want to be max, you can go and dismantle some of the logistic officers you don't want, then use them to purchase the specific piece, which makes rerolling the first two talents slightly easier, assuming that you have enough stamina to even do that. That's pretty much all. In my opinion, this is a lot easier to do than certain impact, but in the same time, since our ability to farm logistic is quite limited at the moment, I don't see myself rerolling for perfect set anytime soon. I would love to hear what you think about the logistic system in this game. Let me know in the comment down below. This has been Steambags, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.